Nemso Indian Defense, Reshevsky Variation, 5, D56.3 B77. CX D5 X5. Intense that was a serious game. White really outplayed Black in that one. Black had a good opening, but White was on another level. White destroyed Black in the middle game. Opening with the Queen's pawn controls the center and usually leads to a more positional development of the pieces. The Indian game begins by controlling the important e4 square with the knight, rather than a pawn. c4 builds a strong center by controlling the important d5 square and creates a square for the knight to come to c3 without blocking the c-pawn. e6 opens up a line for the dark-squared bishop and prepares to castle quickly, while preparing to push a pawn to d5 and recapture with a pawn if captured. And c3 develops the knight to fight for the e4 square and to control d5. In the Nimso Indian defense, bb4 pins the knight on c3, preventing it from moving or protecting e4, and threatens to trade, disrupting white's pawns after bx c3. e3 supports the d4 pawn and allows the light squared bishop and queen to develop. Castling gets the king out of the center and activates the rook. Ne2 develops the knight, protects the c3 knight and the d4 pawn, if black captures on c3, then white can recapture without doubling their c pawns. d5 takes space in the center, attacks the c4 pawn and allows the light squared bishop to develop. a3 forces the bishop to decide, exchange or retreat. b7 retreats the bishop back toward the center, where it supports the knight on f6. cx d5 captures the d5 pawn, attacks the pawn on e6 and controls the c6 square. x5 recaptures the pawn on d5 and controls the e4 and c4 squares. This allows the knight to control more squares. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent avoids some of the attacking associated with opposite side castling. This activates a knight by developing it off of its starting square. Master Games It is the last book move. That's fine. It is good. Very precise. It is best. This is a fair move. It is good. There were worse moves but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. This misses an opportunity to increase a bishop's scope by moving it to a better square. It is a mistake. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Takes back. It is best. That's not a mistake, but it's not the best move either. It is good. The rook is now on an open file, which helps control squares across the board. It is best. This threatens to win a knight. It is best. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This move puts the queen on a safer square. It is best. This overlooks an opportunity to create a passed pawn. It is an inaccuracy. This moves the bishop to a more active square, making it gain scope. This threatens to fork pieces. It is best. This defends the attacked pawn. This threatens to create a passed pawn. It is good. The rooks can see each other now, allowing them to provide mutual defense. This stops the opponent from being able to create a passed pawn. It is excellent. This threatens to create a passed pawn. It is best. This attacks a queen, winning a tempo when it moves away. It is best. This misses an opportunity to win a tempo by threatening a bishop. It is an inaccuracy. There was only one good move in that position. This allows the opponent to create a passed pawn. It is a mistake. This loses a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. This threatens to kick a knight. There was only one good move there. This overlooks a better way to win a pawn. This allows the opponent to win a tempo by threatening a bishop. It is a miss. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it. 
this overlooks an opportunity to add a defender to a vulnerable knight. This allows the opponent to kick a knight. It is a mistake. This wins material. This took advantage of a mistake and white now has a winning advantage. It is a great move. This move puts the knight on a safer square. It is best. That was a great move and very hard to find. This is the only move that works. It is brilliant. An interesting move, although not technically the best. It is excellent. This forks multiple pieces. It is best. That's fine. It is good. This forks pieces by creating a simultaneous attack. It is excellent. This evades the check from the knight. It is forced. That was a truly amazing move. It is brilliant. This allows a forced checkmate. It is an inaccuracy. With the right follow-up, this will lead to checkmate. It is best. Intense that was a serious game. White really outplayed black in that one. Black had a good opening, but white was on another level. White destroyed black in the middle game.